In this video, I'm going to show you one of the best blitzes in Madden 23. This comes out of the Baltimore uh, Ravens defensive playbook. If you guys want to get my full Baltimore Ravens defensive ebook or my full 146 defensive ebook, I think 146 is the best blitzing formation in the game uh, from a sub perspective. And uh, we're going to show you how to run it specifically against U trips, which you can do this against anything. The pressure is just so 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 effective out of 146, and 146 also gives you the flexibility to be able to align properly against any formation. Again, if you want to get my 146 ebook, link is in the description. Patreon members get access to everything, all the ebooks, and uh, we're going to show you how to do this out of the play DB Sting. So all we're going to do is turn our match coverage on. That's more for coverage than anything else. Um, but anyway, the play is DB Sting, and all you're going to do is you're going to come out, you're going to press. You're going to pinch your defensive line, and then you're going to take this linebacker on the right side of the screen, and we're just going to put him in a hard flat. And what you're going to see here, this is a sin five. Um, now, on the left, if you wanted to, you could man the linebacker up on the tight end. You could do that. That's fine. Um, but we're just going to use the running back ourselves. And what you'll see here, running back is a route. We're just going to go guard him. And as you see here, we're getting double edge pressure at the quarterback. Really simple but really, really effective. Again, I'll show you just pinch the defensive line. The blitz angles out of 146 are way better than dollar in my opinion. And again, you're just gonna scream off of the edge. Double edge pressure, very consistent. Um, it's just really hard to block this this year. And the other benefit of running 146 is, um, you know, we could do, we, if, if we wanted to guard the running back, we could do something like this. Like if we wanted to kind of start the running back, we could do a defense that looks kind of like this. And then we're just gonna be kind of helping out more so on the tight end now. So that gives us the ability to kind of lurk over to the trip side. What's also really good about 146 is you don't have to base the lineup for it to be effective. So again, just by pinching the line here, you don't have to baseline this defense for it to be effective. So let's say that they motion across, um, you know, let's say they motion someone like this, you'll see how the defense automatically adjusts really, really well to it. You see right there, super simple adjustment. Um, you know, we might, I don't know what happened, my guys must have misaligned or whatever, but you could easily just do something like this, and then, you know, you could have this guy manned up on the running back, and even with motion over, you're still going to get the double edge heat. So really, really simple, really effective defense uh, out of 146. I just, I, I think 146 is incredible this year. Um, just hard flat this guy, literally just hard flat this guy, and you'll stop probably 80% of the people you play online with this defense. If you want to get the real fine tune adjustments and how to make this defense, Defense for, might go from good to absolutely incredible defense, almost unscorable. Make sure you join our Patreon to get the ebook on this. This defense screams, but it also has some of the best um, coverage concepts in the game that we teach you how to lock down certain formations um, that you can do with this. You know, there's so much you can do with this formation this year. So, anyways, if you want to learn the rest of the Dime 146 defensive ebook, make sure that you join our Patreon. But again, the setup for this, just pinch your D line. And then that's it. Literally just pinch your D-line. Boom. And then you can you can zone out that linebacker and you see how good this defense is.